Okay, so today we're going to make um, what was once called the nun's bread or uh, pain perdue or what is now called the French toast. Now, simple food, but this is a very, um, you can get a lot of taste out of this food. So let's start with the history. So the French toast wasn't actually from France but it originated from the Roman era where families were poor and they didn't have much to eat. And they had toast, milk, and eggs. And they're thinking, you know, what can we make out of this? And so that's how um, the French toast idea of the food came from. But then um, it then somehow got called French toast, even though it wasn't from there. And then it, the food got passed on into America, and that's and over Europe, so that's why we eat it. So now that you've known a uh, history, simple history of the food, um, let's start with the ingredients. And then for French toast, you need cinnamon, vanilla, eggs, milk, uh, a little pinch of salt, uh, butter, and the most important toast. And vanilla and cinnamon is what brings out the flavor, but it wasn't added before. And um, French toast before was made from stale bread, but now, or it could be used from leftover toast because families didn't have money. Um, yeah, and so now that you know the ingredients, let's start mixing. Um, yeah, you can basically just take all these ingredients, uh, eggs, Milk. Now, I already measured these, by the way. Vanilla, you don't just randomly add random amounts. Uh, cinnamon, and you just start, you just mix it together. So, this is really easy to make, uh, especially if you're bored at home and you have nothing to do, and if you have these ingredients to do it easier. Um, alright. So I like to take one of these little containers that are in the shape of like a little toast. So it's easier to dip um, the toast in. And once you have kind of stirred it completely, um, you can just pour it in one of these containers and dip the toast, dip the toast in here for about, oh, uh, you want to dip it for, for both sides. And I'll wash my hands, don't worry. That's the first step you guys should always do. And make sure that your um, oven or electric griddle, griddle, griddle is um, preheated before you put anything on. Um, you can also use a uh, pan, but the electric griddle is easier. So what you want to do is you want to after you preheat it, rub some butter on it. Uh, this gives it a good texture. I like butter. <laughs> and then once you've soaked your French toast, or your toast, you can just put it on. Let this sizzle. Yeah. So, I'm going to let that cook and I'm going to cook more. Be careful with that. Alright, so, today we've learned the history of French toast um, was made for poor families, and uh, this is what they come up with. And it wasn't really from French, France. Um, the ingredients you need: eggs, vanilla, cinnamon, salt, um, and toast. A little bit of butter, and yeah, you can put it in a pan or electric grill. Yeah. Thank you. All right.